I thought I'd do fireside chats, I guess. It's it's winter here at the moment. Anyways, people ask me uh, sometimes, where did this idea come from? Because it is not a wind turbine and quite unique. But the truth is, if you look at that picture, that is exactly where I grew up. That was our land. And the one thing we used to do was we were caretakers of the river. We'd walk right in and bottles and cans and bicycles and sneakers. And one day I was just around the bend there. Now, the river was not moving that quick, but there was an old soggy board, quite large, and I went to pick it up. And I could not believe the amount of pressure coming off of that. And that always stuck in my mind. And then one thing happened a few years later is my parents gave me a grandfather clock. It was broken. And inside it, it had one of those mechanisms where you normally lift the weight and then it would take care of itself for many, many days. But it was broken. And when you pulled on the chain, in this case, the internal mechanism raced it went really, really fast. And I never forgot that, ever. And it went on to become an engineer. And I remember walking down the hallways, I think third year, still in the back of my mind, pressure and watching that mechanism go. Well, after I graduated, I went out and I contacted an old man. He was a clock maker and he had quite a collection of old clock mechanisms and he, he gave me one, much stronger. And then I went and bought a used parachute, an old military parachute. And in the middle of winter, just like this, it was windy. I went outside and I thought, let's just see if this works. I attached the mechanism to the parachute. The parachute opened up and just pulled me off the ground. But the mechanism spun like crazy. And I went, there it is. Pressure, wind, this kind of mechanism. And that's where it all started.